is the Dubai like marina area. You can see somewhere over here, you can see the building I live in. So nice, quiet stroll. Today's walk, because it is almost the end of September, it is now pumpkin spice latte season. What that means, I actually don't really know. I've never even had a pumpkin spice latte, but it's sweater, what, sweater weather regardless. So I am wearing a nice little knitted top from Fashion Nova. It came with a matching skirt, but I didn't like it. So instead I paired it with everybody's favorite tiny little jean shorts and a pair of white sneakers because you know, we're walking. Um, Harry is in some cute little pigtails today, you guys. I never wear pigtails, but I don't know. I'm here for it. I am here for the pigtails. I think they look awesome. Let me know what you think, if you're a pigtail fan or not, but pigtails are here to stay today. So that's my little outfit. Um, and I'm also wearing just a pair of sunglasses I picked up while I was in Istanbul. So this is what I'm rocking today on my little stroll, just getting some steps in, getting some exercise, looking for some of my cat friends. So as you guys know, I do tons and tons of walking. I love to go for walks. It's like one of my top hobbies. So I do about 15 to 20,000 steps a day. I track it on my Fitbit. Now I'm curious, do you guys like track your steps? Do you use a Fitbit or an Apple Watch or anything like that? I also do a little bit of cardio on the treadmill a few days a week, but for the most part, I just love walking outside, seeing places, getting the fresh air, the heat here for it all so look at this skyline you guys this is the like Dubai Marina you can see some of the most iconic towers here you actually can't see the Burj Khalifa from here I mean you can but only on an incredibly clear day which it is not there's usually a little bit of like dust or haze in there because you know I live in the desert so I'm gonna jump up here on the sidewalk because it's just a nice view so yeah, back to the steps. I do about 15, 20,000 steps a day. It's about 15 kilometers for my friends that understand kilometers. If you're in the US, you'll have to just Google the difference because I can't figure it out for you. But yeah, so do you guys do steps? What do you do? This here is a new uh, tower in the background of the building. The sun is right behind it. There are only two of them. This is the first one. The second one's going to be double that height and it's like uh, hotel offices retail I think some residences and stuff too but my god it is huge and it went up so fast when I first got here not first got here but when I came here um, about a year ago they were they didn't even have the glass on it and now it's just like it's a marvel how quickly they can do things here and these like towers just engineering feats it's incredible to see and be able to watch so I'm excited to see the next one when it comes anyways this reminds me I can see these uh, trees up here the other day when I was walking here because I like this area there's nobody around it's nice and quiet it's peaceful other than the traffic in this one spot anyways the trees up here full of green parrots you guys green parrots what the heck were they doing in the trees I'll never know but there was about 30 of them and I'd never seen wild parrots before like that. So I'm not sure if they were like somebody's pets or they just like flock together. I don't know. But maybe we'll see if we can see them today. One of my other favorite things about this walk is all of my little cat friends. Sometimes I bring treats and I get so many friends when I do that, but I didn't bring treats today. I only brought my water bottle. So if we see any cats, we'll say hello. It's one of my favorite parts of the walk. I love visiting with them, petting them, you know, feeding them. They're also usually quite friendly and very, very chatty. So if you guys have been following along for a while since I started my channel, you would know that I do actually have a little cat back in Canada. He is currently at my parents' house, so he lives with grandma and grandpa because unfortunately shipping a cat overseas is madness. Oh, speak of cats, here's a little black guy. Ooh, yuck, this is really crunchy grass. Hi! Oh, he's got little white armpits. How's you today? Come here. I just want to come. Honestly, you guys, this grass is like 
kind of gross to step on. It feels like I'm walking on ramen noodles. Here it comes. Sometimes I name the cats. I'm sure it's not their given names, but it's what I like to call them. <laughs> but anyway, so I have my little uh, baby cat back home in Canada, staying with uh, Grandma and Grandpa. He's happy there. They have a little dog that he plays with and whatever. And Mom and Dad, if you're watching this video, you guys are the best. Thanks for looking after him. But I miss him. And like I said, it is in extreme challenge to get an animal to the other side of the world so i'm not sure exactly what to do but i do miss him and like i said his name's baby cat so he'll have to let me know my parents call him bandit which is his other name too so either one works you'll have to let me know if you have any pets and what their names are it's crazy the things we'll do for our pets you know but he's happy i'm happy they're happy everybody's happy this baby's happy. You know, it's interesting being in the UAE here and Dubai in, in particular is it's actually against the law to film people without their permission. So something I am very cautious of. I know I get a lot of comments in my videos about that there's no one else around and that's because you're not allowed to have other people in your videos or to take their picture or whatever so if you're one of those weird people that films other people without them knowing just know that it is illegal in some parts of the world and uh it's actually not that nice now speaking of videos now's a good time to mention if you haven't done so already make sure you are subscribed to my channel i love making this content for you guys and I love seeing that you guys are watching it, the views. I love reading the comments. I do see them all, so be nice. Um, but yeah, subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. There's a little tip button if you want to support me. It means a lot if you do. Oh, here's another little cat friend. We'll catch up with him. Oh, he's running. He's excited to see me. Anyways, yeah, so make sure you subscribe and check out my VIP site, autumnblairxo.com. Oh, look him cute. Hi. Can you hear him in the microphone? He's got a little beauty mark on his face. He looks like Marilyn Monroe. Also, I refer to most things as he and him and his. So, I mean, no disrespect to the cats in whatever way they identify, but they're just, it's easier that way for me. <laughs> Look how cute he is. Hi. You know, there was a cat in my building. Sometimes the people in my building let their cats just roam around in the hallways, which I don't really understand, but it just seems to be an acceptable practice here. But anyways, there was a cat in the hallway and I tried to pet him. He scratched me really hard. So I'm a little bit nervous to pet the cats because I thought this guy would be friendly and he wasn't. So. Also, because they're like outside cats, you never know. You never know. I don't want to have to go to the doctor saying I tried to pet a stray cat and he scratched me or bitted me. So, always be careful. I also need to take a minute just to talk about how beautiful the scenery is. Like, this walk is absolutely breathtaking to me. Like I said earlier, it's so peaceful. I mean, look at the skyline, the little bridges they have, everything. It is just, I feel so fortunate that this is where I get to walk. It's just making my heart happy. Do you have a favorite place to walk or exercise or go? This is like, this is my happy place. This is like as good as life gets to me, you know? What is the saying? Hashtag blessed? Maybe.
hold my pigtail. All right, you guys, I think we are going to wrap up this video. I just want to take a second and say thank you so much for coming on our little adventure walk today. I must remove my phone from my shorts because it's too heavy, it's pulling them down. Anyways, um, yeah, it's, I know I said it's September, it's sweater weather, but I lied. It is still September, but it's definitely not sweater weather here. So I am quite warm. I'm just going to go uh, finish my walk here, cool off, have a drink, all that fun stuff. But I just want to say again, thanks so much for coming along with me today and joining me. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. It really, really means a lot. Give this video a big thumbs up and leave me some comments. Answer some of the questions I asked. Uh, let me know in the comments below how you're doing if you uh, watch this whole video to the end. And hit that tip button, check out my VIP site, autumnblairxo.com. And until next time, guys, bye.